Hello there, friend. Jackie Holland here. I hadn't talked to you in a little bit. Just wanted to check in, let you know, yes, I'm still alive. I'm still, I'm still here. Uh, I've been going through a few things, as you know, for the last several months. But God have mercy, haven't we all? When I listen to some of the reports and, and hear the stories, I think, well, you know what? You feel like a lone ranger sometimes, don't you? But then you discover you're not by yourself at all. Other people are going through struggles. So I've had diverticulitis and, and uh, all, you know, lymphoma, all these things that uh, I was dealing with and so I was in the hospital. And I've been out of the hospital for, for a few weeks, but for a few weeks I've been taking these, uh, you can't see it here, but it's like a little uh, infusion, you know, you, they go up and around, it's a pick line, they call it pick line. And they can give you your medicine, they can take blood. And uh, so every day I go in for that. And so I have a few more weeks left of that. Still got some infections, still dealing with some things, still not well, but I'm doing what God wants me to do because I'm praising him and I'm loving him and I'm praying for you. Did you know that you're on my mind, you're in my heart? And I'm asking God, but everybody that hears my voice right now, that you feel the love of God, that you feel the peace of God, that you feel faith rise up in you and hope rise up in you. And you say, I can do this. And don't fear the impossible, but do, the, do that that seems impossible because God will make it possible if you believe in Him and trust in Him. Put your faith in Jesus. On, on my t-shirt, you know, it just says, Never stop exploring. Well, let's never stop exploring. So find out what God wants for you. I'll find out what God wants for me, and let's keep on going. Let's win souls. Got a letter, well, from inmates, and always blesses me. We got a call from the chaplain uh, at the prison. I said, we're ready for you to start back teaching. And so I said, as soon as I can uh, clear up this infection, I will be right there. And so that was really good. So I look forward to that. But there'll be much time for outreach. But outreach is wherever you're at. Be kind one to another, love one another. Life is short. Oh boy. Expect the unexpected. That's it, that you're not gonna get you're not gonna get rolled over and of one bite. And say, no, 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 no. God is my refuge and my strength and my ever present help in the trouble. So remember, say, I'm loved. I'm cared for. God's watching over me. He's my healer. If you've never asked Jesus into your heart, you can ask him. You never know. Yesterday, a lot of people thought the eclipse was hoping that the end of the world. I didn't, I was curious about why, why are they, what do they really want? Well, I read this article today and and the guy said, if they were looking for the end of the world, well, there was no end of the world. <laughs> but you know what? You could stump your toe and break, break your neck today, and it could be the end of this side of the world, as you know. So make your decision about Jesus today. Today, don't be looking up, don't be looking around, but be looking ready. Because... God is watching over everything that concerns you. Just say, Dear Heavenly Father, I come to you now in Jesus' name. I ask you to forgive me of my sins and cleanse my heart of all unrighteousness. I love you, Lord. I praise you, Lord. I magnify you, Lord. I exalt you, Lord. I honor you, Lord. Forgive me of my sins and anyone I've hurt. God, bless those that have but that have been cruel even to me. Bless them, Lord. Lord, let me show kindness and mercy and love. Fill me with your Holy Spirit and your fire, in Jesus' name. And let your healing flow. Let the healing waters flow. I speak healing over my body. And that just healing, just, you know, 
when I get those infusions that they're just going right in. <laughs> yeah, it's going right in there, trying to attack whatever critter it is trying to kill me, which is, you know, the devil wants to steal, kill, and destroy, but God said I've given, to, given you life more abundantly. I don't really think you, think you can die unless the Lord allows it, so that's my personal opinion, but boy, he can sure make trouble. So be thankful, be, be in praise, watch out, and look up for the Lord, not, not for the end of the world. Look for Jesus, the author and the finisher of your faith. If you ever want to write me, my post office box is 57 Sherman, Texas 75091. P.O. Box 57, Sherman, Texas, 75091. And the uh, website, you could text me, uh, is JackieHollandMinistries.com. Or, no, or go to, just check out our page. I love you. Let me hear from you. I, I, I know I didn't go fix up or anything. I just got back from the doctor. But I, I thought at first I'm not going to do a, do a video. And then I thought, no. No, because I, God's kept me alive, and so I must go forward and encourage others. And I would say, you do the same thing. God is for you. Who can be against you? Nobody. I love you. Oh, oh golly. Oh, golly, golly. Mm -hmm.